Today is that day we're going to go ahead and breathe life back into the two CPU miners that I had running. Um, I shut these guys down about a month ago. And of course, you know, you can see all the dust they've collected. We're gonna clean those off. We're going to go ahead and bring those into the crypto mining room and actually start doing the process of setting them up again for either crypto mining or, or actually I think I'm about doing some salad some AI machine. So we'll go ahead and uh, get at this and that way you don't have to listen to the air compressor behind me. So let's get these things cleaned off and uh, we'll go ahead and take them in the other room. This is gonna be a quick video. Really, I'm just uh, letting you guys know what I'm getting ready to do. I appreciate any likes, subscribes down below, but more so, Give me some comments. What do you think I should do? I was mining Qubit with both, both these rigs. I don't think I want to do any more Cubic. I'm going to turn them back on, but I think I might only run one of them temporarily, take the memory off of one, put it on the other, and set up one board here as a AI salad rig and go that route. So let me know your, your comments about that. Or do you think there's a different CPU coin I should go after? Anyway, let me know. Now it's gonna get noisy. Hang in there. And when I clean out these fans and stuff, I am holding the fan here. I'll spin this around because I do want to blow the stuff out and not into the grids here, so. Okay, there we have it. So these things are looking not brand new, but just we're hitting them with the air compressor there real quick. These things are looking nice. We're gonna go ahead and go ahead. We're gonna move them into the room. We have Windows 11 now installed. We also have the salad, uh, I don't know, AI miner workload task or whatever you want to call it. That is installed and it's been running now a little over 48 hours. Now, my number's gonna be a little bit weird because I also have another machine running it uh, in my house. And so the, the, the total balance is going to look a little bit off, but I want to go over where I'm at. So let's go ahead and take a peek here. Oh, first of all, this is going to be a second one. The first one, I have it powered on underneath, sitting on top of my Synology for now. Here you can see it's a running. Nothing special. It's just the current home for it. So I'm looking for input from you guys. So please leave comments below because I almost guarantee I'm not doing something quite right. Uh, I don't know what else I can do to configure things. So leave me comments, suggestions, anything down below. I much appreciate it. Uh, right now, as you can see, well, let's pull up the actual web page. Okay. Well, here. 
I'll show you the, the computer I have also running inside the house. And this is where one of my questions is coming in. The computer running inside the house has uh, a NVIDIA 3060 video card, just like this rig, but it's a less powerful CPU and it has a lot less memory. It's only got 32 gig of memory. So the green only has 32 gig of memory. The amber or magenta is the salad rig I just set up right down here. It's got an NVIDIA 3060 running on it and it's got 64 gig of memory. So double the memory and it's also got a CPU that far outshines. The CPU here is a Ryzen 9 5950X 16 core processor. The one I have in my house is only a six core CPU. So 16 cores versus six core. And then the video cards are identical and it, I'm almost seeing that the lesser machine seems to be getting more work. So I'm not sure why this is, what this may be a result of. So please leave me feedback below so I can, uh, or any suggestions or things to look at below. Because this is part of salad uh, mining that I'm confused with. Now we're at about 48 hours plus another eight. So what is that, 56 hours? And this thing has got about, we'll call it 15 kilowatt hours that it's, it's burned through. Um, I know this power supply down here is overkill for just the one motherboard. Uh, so that 650 watt is actually going to be driving the second motherboard um, once I get everything set up. So I'll save some power by using the one power supply for both, but that's for later. So I did the math after 24 hours. It looked like this one rig got about 25 cents of workloads in a day. Now, I'm not sure if that's normal for a 3060 uh, video card or not. So please let me know below. Um, yeah, what do you guys see from a rig running a NVIDIA 3060 12 gig video card? Not a Founders Edition, not a TI, just a generic 3060. Um, again, I don't wanna have to buy more video cards. I'm just trying to use ones that I already have here. So let me know in the comments below what you think. And then just to kind of go over some more of the hardware aspects here. The motherboard, well, here's the motherboard. It's a B50 or 550 gaming XV2 motherboard. AM socket, AM4, um, running 64 gigabytes of memory. Let's see, I think I can show you the speed of the memory. Is what is that? Uh, 2666 memory. Um, I know that's not the fastest memory, but is that part of why I'm seeing my lesser computer seem to be getting more work, more or work that pays more? Or is it just purely random? 